Our 55% hemp, 45% organic cotton jersey knit is all made in our facility here in Concord, North Carolina. So our hemp jersey knit goes through about eight processes. It's knit, batched, dyed, slid open, framed, and then compacted. So after our fabric is knit and batched, our dye bath uses a one to four dye to water ratio, which uses less water and less dye to create more sustainable fabric for our apparel manufacturers. After our fabric is dyed, it's slid open. Now that the fabric is in open width form, it's being padded with a 3% natural softener and it's about to be put on the frame to be gummed and trimmed. The edge of our hemp cotton jersey knit is gummed on the side so you can cut it without the sides fraying in. The gum uses a natural consistency of glue and water. You can now see the hemp jersey knit going through the dryer. The dryer allows our hemp fabric to achieve a 3.2 shrinkage in the horizontal and vertical direction, about a 1.2 torque. This is extremely beneficial and unheard of for a 55% hemp fabric. The last process in the finishing is compacting. Compacting lettuce goes through one more step of quality control where we can make sure there's no holes, that the dye is consistent, that the shrinkage and torque are 100% consistent throughout the fabric. We look forward to making your hemp textiles for you. We knit all of our jersey knit hemp blends here in Concord, North Carolina. Uh, it ranges anywhere from 30% to 50%, and some of it has spandex, recycled cotton, uh, even 100% organic cotton. So the clientele that I work with on a daily basis really ranges from everyone from furniture upholstery to fashion designers and apparel brands. Baby brands, t-shirt manufacturers, dental manufacturers, everyone in between that are looking to bring manufacturing back to the U.S. by producing sustainable, honest textiles. We verify all of our hemp yarn with microscopy and antimicrobial testing. All of our testing is done by a third-party ISO certified lab. Our business model focuses on make-to-order manufacturing and rapid R&D of hemp fabrics. With our plans to open a spinning facility by 2021, we'll have a better shot at controlling the pricing and quality of our goods as they move through the supply chain. Our goal is to create another sustainable avenue for the American industrial hemp market to continue to see growth through.